What is going on boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, the ACMGS Gamer here. Today we are here to go over some new information regarding Assassin's Creed Mirage, but before we go over that I just wanted to let you guys see the previous inventory screens that we have seen in previous games. Um, this is the Origins, a um, little complicated as you can see we have two melee weapons, uh, two ranged outfit mount shield tool, and the various crafting elements at the bottom. This was uh, the first RPG quote unquote game of the trilogy. Um, and, uh, you know, a lot of people were fine with that. I'm fine with this. But, you know, it looks a little complicated. And move on to Odyssey. We got even more complicated where you can see they decided to do each individual piece could be swapped out compared to Origins, where. You had an outfit that you could swap out, but the individual pieces of armor you didn't actually swap gear, you just upgraded. So that's where you have that. And then we move on to Valhalla, where they kept the same thing as Odyssey, except it's everything was separate now. Where you had each individual piece, and you had um, each different weapon. So now we're going to swap over to the inventory for Mirage that was just revealed today. Very simple. It's a lot simpler than you would think. You simply have the outfit that Bassam wears that we know gets changed because he moves from an apprentice, or sorry, from a street thief to apprentice to master. Um, we know he goes from the blue and white hood to eventually the white and red hood that Altair will have. Um, on the right, you have the costume, which uh, I'm assuming legacy outfits or like the, the sand outfit, which is the Prince Persia outfits, will all be there, I'm assuming. Um, on the bottom right, there, or sorry, middle right, is the talisman. Uh, I'm assuming that's just going to be a charm for like a set, uh, for uh, like um, siege, where you have different charms you can put on your uh, weapons. It'll be interesting to see how you unlock those or if there's just one, but if they have a whole section, I'm assuming you can find multiple. Um, and then on the bottom right there is a dagger. Uh, and then on the bottom left is also a sword. Uh, middle left is outfit die, and then the outfit. Um, so with that being said, we also have resources on both sides. It looks like very similar to um, Valhalla, where you have like nails or scrap and ingots and cloth maybe, and then various materials on the right there that we've seen that you gain through doing different types of contracts all of those rewards were in that video and of course over on the uh, right side there you see the rank that Bassam currently is now something interesting is about the sword and the dagger we do know that there are not uh, th there's no other weapons except for the sword and the dagger I do not think that we'll be able to swap them from these slots. I think Bassam will be stuck with using the sword in his right hand and the dagger in his left. Um, I do believe that you can upgrade your swords and you can swap them out with cosmetics. That's as far as the extent that I know. We won't know anymore until um, the game comes out. So that is the inventory menu. And then we're going to skip past this for now and go to the, this is the second tab, is the die. As you can see here, the initiate, um, they don't really lock you out of anything. Um, you have orange, green, and gray, white, blue, purple, white, orange, blue, or blue and green, I'm not sure what that is. Uh, it looks brown, white, and blue, green, red, and brown, purple, gold, white, purple, green, yellow, maybe, I don't know, uh, black, purple, tan, and then orange, yellow, and white. Um, so those are some interesting dyes. Not sure how those are unlocked. I'm sure we'll find out soon enough. And then we come to the cream of the crop, if you will, of um, this video. It's going to take a little bit to get through. So we have three skill trees. Um, a lot of people were not aware of that. Um, shockingly, even though they kind of said that uh, in the beginning before the videos came out. Um, you have the Phantom Trickster and Predator trees. The Phantom 
tree will go over is more of a it looks to seem or seems like more of a combat parkour based tree um, the first one there is breakfall which is where Bassam will roll when he lands um, the second one there is airstrike which is time slows down when you aim a knife the one in the middle there is kickback after a successful parry you press Y or triangle depending on your console uh, to kick an opponent um, maybe this is used to break an opponent's guard I'm not sure um, let's see, and then, uh, on the right side there is the chain assassination, which we've seen in action, which is, if you take out one guy, you can take out a second guy. Um, not sure what the arrow target is used for. And then the bottom one there looks like it's going to be the dodge roll. We're not entirely sure what some of these are or what their, um, gameplay is. Uh, mechanics will be. In the middle there's the trickster roll. Uh, we have the auto loot at the very top there. Something to do with health in the middle. Um, that one over there looks like something to do with the knife, which I think will be throwing knives. Don't Maybe it'll increase the amount you can have or the amount of time times you can throw them or I don't, I don't know. Um, and then the left of that one you have the uh, thief. Not sure what that is. Maybe you'll be able to pickpocket citizens for more money. Um, who knows? And then that last one, not sure what that is. But then if you look over on the right there, it's the Predator. Two things having to do with an eagle, and then the last one there, on the bottom right, looks like it'll be, have something to do with Assassin Focus. And that's simply all we have um, for today. They released all of this in a new, about five minute dev diary. Um, I compiled a bunch of different clips together to shorten the five minutes into more like a minute of all of the new combat, including footage of where all of this is seen. So if you want to go watch that to see the, visual, the visuals that accompany all of this, head on over to that video. I'll leave it in the link down in the description down below. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.